I'm going to show you a few features of the app Writing Wizard today. To add your own lists, simply go to My Words and then go to Word Lists. Here you'll have any of the word lists that are already uh, added on this iPad. To create a new list, click New List, and from here you're going to type the name of the list, so you might call it Sight Words or maybe Unit 1, Week 1, something like that. When you're done, press Save. Then it may ask you to ask, access the microphone. You can click OK. Then you're going to enter the word. So I'm going to enter my word. And if you want to, you can also add audio. So what that will do is when the students are practicing, it, they will hear your voice reading that word. So if you would like to do that, press record. Like. And then you can check it by pressing play. And then when you're done, press save. Now if you need to add another word, simply repeat that process, add a word, type it in, record audio if you want, and press save. Now, once you're done, you can go back to choose word lists, and you'll notice that your sight words list shows up in the list there. Another feature of Writing Wizard is you can change the font. So if you go to settings, and under font, you can choose a few different. So they have like Zaner Bloser, they have Danelian, a few other things. You can simply change that font at any time and then go back to main settings and click done. To receive new word lists on your other iPads or from a colleague's iPads, simply go to my words, choose word lists, choose import, export, and receive lists from nearby devices. A button may pop up to prompt you to accept. If so, please click accept. Once you have set up all of the other iPads to receive lists, then go to the, the iPad where you created your original list. Go to My Words, choose Word Lists, click Import Export, and then click Send Lists to Nearby Devices. Now this step you can do with um, several devices all at once. So what you want to do is click on the list or lists. You can select more than one at a time. Click on the list or list that you would like to send. Now notice there's also a toggle switch near the top that says include recorded letter sounds. So if you have audio, you may want to um, turn that toggle on. Once you've selected all of your lists, then down at the bottom you should see um, all of the devices that are ready to receive the lists. Once you see all of them there, click Send Lists, and then you're done.